So you might be trying to figure out how you can get an actual file manager inside of your particular you know, application, inside of your MetaQuest. Now, doing this is actually pretty basic for the most part. There's a couple of different things. I mean, one, you have a built-in files app that you can kind of use inside of your particular MetaQuest. But to get a full-blown you know, file manager, the only way to do this is that you will have to basically go through and have side quests enabled on your particular MetaQuest. So this is basically just a way to go ahead and basically you know, jailbreak your MetaQuest. So if you want to, I'll leave instructions in the description if you want to side quest it. If I'm able to, if I'm not able to side, you know, put links down there, then the best thing to do is probably just, you know, look up how to side quest matter your meta quest that you have. And that is basically the main way to go and do this. Now, once you have a particular meta quest that's basically side quested, the next thing you're going to want to do here is you want to go and basically install an APK file, which allows you of that particular meta quest. So you can go inside of, you know, APK mirror, you can go inside of any sort of website like that. And all these websites should have a little option, which will allow you to, you know, download a particular a files application. A lot of people use, you know, ES file explorer. My personal one was a root browser. That's the one I used a lot. So you can find the one that you actually prefer and the one you actually like. And from there, you can just search up the APK file of that. And all you're going to have to do there is to download that APK file. So once you have that APK file downloaded, what you're going to want to do is you want to install that APK file via side quest. Now there's instructions on how to do this exactly in the link down in the description as well. So you can just go and go down there and you know look up how to install the APK file via SideQuest. And from there, that's all you're really going to have to do. You should be good to go from that point. And at that point, what I'd recommend doing is install the APK file. You can then go ahead and open up that you know particular the file manager from there. You can go and see all the files within your particular headset. So that pretty much covers it up there. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that means so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.